So this is a new thing which you may be familiar with. I'm not sure how much uh, you've been able to delve into this, but uh, more and more um, student housing is being built by private developers because most universities don't have the land or the funds to accommodate all the students. And we know that students do much better. They're much more likely to succeed. They're much more later, uh, likely to have a good, positive, collegiate experience if they're either on campus with fellow students or as close to the campus as possible. I'm concerned that I, I've thought of this the last few days because I've gone down Monta Vista and even though it's just summer school to think of 600 students having to walk across those two intersections to get to school um, that it's going to be really a traffic problem because you do get backed up. They have a little button on their side of the the thing that they can push to get across and it causes a lot of trouble. I'm really thinking maybe they should be considering making some kind of overpass there for the walkers and the bikes. But my concern is, is when my neighbors that surround me are all retired. I'm due to retire in two years. And we knew that the, it was something that was going to be developed in the back. We didn't know what. We were hoping for commercial property or things like that. And to have a three or four story go into your backyard, that means lights are going to be shining in our houses all the time. And college kids, come on now. You know that they're going to party. I don't care if you have um, a person in each room. You know, they, kids like to party. They like to do things. I agree with many of these people out here. Uh, Monte Vista, during certain times of the day, certain times of the year, is extremely busy. And I think that that's just a planning commission problem in general where you guys need to really address, you know, I think that that overhead walk, walkway is a great idea. Um, it also is a lot safer. You know, you, you decrease the chance of someone getting hit by a car. And, uh, you know, I just, overall, I think this is a good project. There maybe need to be several adaptations made for the people that live here, but ultimately, this city, one of its pride and joys is the university. And we have to accommodate what is at the university, and those are our students.